Okay, Ben played 15 games of basketball. Here are his points in each game. So we need to draw a box plot. They've already ordered the numbers, which is great. Um, what information goes on the box plot? Um, we need to know the lowest number, the highest number. We're going to need to work out the median. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven off this side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven off this side. So 22 is the median. And then the quartiles. So if I chop this in half, so half this side, half this side, and I work out almost the median again. So one, two, three, one, two, three. So 18 is the lower quartile. One, two, three. One, two, three. 26 is the upper quartile. So that's all the information we need to go onto the box plot. Uh, we haven't got a scale on here yet. Um, we need to go from what? Well, so if I go from 15, um, 20, 25, 30. So 15, 20, 25, 30. So each one is four. So four little lines would give me one. So yeah, it'd be 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, and 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. So we've worked that one out. Now we just need to draw our lines on. So the lowest is 17. So that's here. It doesn't really matter how big you make the, um, the boxes and the whiskers. I'm gonna try and get it right. So that's 17. We've got 18 as the, I'm doing the same size. 18 as the lower quartile, 22 as the median. That's this one. Oops. Let's straighten that back up. Twenty-six is the upper quartile, and twenty-eight is the highest. So we've got a box in the middle. And that's what the box plot looks like. So we've got, that's drawn, that's finished. So Sam plays the same 15 games of basketball. His median was 23. So Ben's was 22. His interquartile range was 12. So that's the gap between the two quartiles. So the upper quartile take away the lower quartile. 12 take away 18. Ben's was 8. And his range was 20, um, 28 take away 17, Ben's was 11. So who is more consistent at scoring points? So their medians are roughly the same. Uh, we've got 22 and 23. So their middle score is roughly the same. But the spread is, is less for Ben. Sam's results are more spread out. So we could say that Ben is more consistent because Sam's results are more spread out. So Ben is more consistent. Um, consistent because his interquartile range and range are lower showing his scores are less spread out.